today I am in a very magical shop called Punny Jukes and I really wanted to give you a tour and I'm actually here with K2. <laughs> now this is your shop, isn't Hi. it? <laughs> yes it is. Yeah, so she runs Punny Jukes and it's so magical. Do you want to tell me how the store kind of became a thing? Yeah, so basically um, we started a Kickstarter um, sort of October last year and we got funded half of what we needed to make to set it up and make it a reality um, so loads of people pitched in and pledged money because they they kind of believed in our magical dream and wanted it to everyone should believe in magical dreams they should magic is real there's so many magical things that are sold here so you've got prints you've got magical pin badges you've got some of your own stuff because you yes. also have another shop called Katie Abbey she's a fantastic illustrator I'll show you some of her stuff in a little bit but everything magical that you can think of cushions mugs uh what else is here candles yeah, incense some... i bought a cauldron the other day oh, from here yep yeah, for my magical shells but i'm going to be showing you around this shop and i hope you're going to enjoy it and where can people find punny dukes um we are um, based in matlock which is in derbyshire um, and it's a really really nice little town it's gorgeous and um, we always used to come here as kids um like sort of like as a nice day out yeah, there's so many nice shops and cafes and in the countryside. It's yeah, perfect. so if you're ever in Matlock, definitely come and check out Punny Jukes and I will leave their Instagram down below and everything that you can find from the shop. Just go in the description down below. But for now, I'm gonna take you around this shop because it's very magical. Look at the ceiling. Oh my God, let's go. Entering the shop is quite overwhelming in the most magical way possible. There's so much to look at and yes, that's a giant owl. We're walking into my favourite room at Punny Dukes now because it's where they keep all of the magical pins. So many pins. The product displays in the shop are amazing, they're also unique and also handcrafted which I think is really really cool. Halfway through the shop you'll come to a hidden room which is dedicated to Katie Abbey products. There's birthday cards, postcards, all of them are illustrated by Katie herself and they're covered in puns. It's like a rainbow has actually exploded in this room, it's really really bright and colourful. Not only are there cards, there's also things like bags, socks, cushions and pins. One of the main attractions to Punny Dukes for me personally is the decor. It's one of the most beautiful shops that I have ever been in. Now, what's interesting is every time you spend £10, you get a house point and the winning house of the previous month then gets a small discount for the following month. I personally really love this feature, I think it's a lot of fun, and you also get little loyalty cards with your house on. And Punny Dukes actually have four houses. They have Gryffindor, Hufflepug, Ravenpaw, and Slotherin. I am personally in the house Gryffindor. Every time I visit Punny Dukes, I spot things that I have never noticed before. It's like Matlock's very own room of requirement, filled with whimsical, magical items. Be sure to have a look up and down and all around when you're in the shop because the ceiling is beautiful and all of the little decor bits dotted around. It really does make this whole shop really magical in every aspect. Now what would a magical shop be without wands? Punny Dukes does actually sell them and they have some lovely handcrafted wooden ones for you to choose from. They sell a lot of stickers as well which I'm a big fan of. I like to put my stickers on my guitars and ah oh, just look at all those beautiful suitcases. I live for that kind of stuff. 
Now Katie actually told me that this next thing here, the beaky cauldron, it's actually 3D printed and it has a little beak and some little feathers. One of the best things that I really love about this shop is that it supports so many small independent businesses. There's a lovely variety of magical wizarding wares. So as I've mentioned, pins are my kind of weakness and Punny Dukes have so many different pins and I'm gonna show you a few of my favorites in here. So we've got the Howler by Phantom Flare and then we've also got an Oddment and Tweak pin which is of Slughorn's Hourglass. Like there are pins absolutely everywhere. We've got the Demi Guys, Flying Keys. Oh my goodness, it is like a pin happiness on a shelf, so that's really cool. And there's even more pins here, which are by Katie. They're really cute. This one is a Dumblebee. <laughs> Dumblebee, that's so cute. And oh, I just love everything. All the little kind of quirky things in here, like the ships, we've got the cases, and then this actually has a ship handle, which, oh, that's squeaky. <laughs> One thing that I completely love about this shop is the decor. So we've got some brick wall here and as you go up, you've actually got clouds and cards all over the ceiling. And here you can actually see a unicorn. So that's the ceiling and it's just a stunning shop to be in. Let's follow the yellow brick road down to the front of the shop. Now they've got some really cute things here. They have these little ceramic kind of dragons and they have adoption certificates so you can adopt your very own dragon. Some of my favorite magical puns that you can find here are actually based around Severus Snape. They are absolutely hilarious. There's so many different card stands dotted around the shop. These would be absolutely perfect to fill one of those multi-frame kind of photo frames, which I have above my desk. And they also do loads of little crystals. I think they're about a pound each and you can fill your own bag. And oh my god, I love this Quidditch Cup flag because I really, really, really want one. It's just so cute. I found this really cool cocktail book and it's kind of like a cocktails for wizards. So they've got loads of little random things like that. There's key rings, even more stickers that are surrounding the magical theme. There's moon notebooks and they even have crocheted little peanut key rings, which is so random, but I'm so here for it. There's time turner stickers as well. And they've got loads of patches. This one's hilarious because it's a soulmate patch with a Dementor on it. Of course they have teeny tiny broomsticks so that you can have your very own witch's broom without getting a full sized one so I just thought that was a really sweet idea. There's coasters, seriously they have thought of everything in this shop, they've made everything that you could possibly want magical. Some of the other things that I really love here are the art prints and they're by loads of different individual artists so you'd be bound to find one that you like. They'd actually be really great if you were designing a magical themed art wall. So obviously I love the magical pins in Punny Jukes, but I really, really adore Katie's pins as well. There's like a Poo Brain one, a Taco Cat, Cozy Club, I'm definitely a part of that club. A lot of her pins are really cute, funny, and some of them can be a little bit explicit, but they're just really hilarious. Oh my god, I really need to get that mug of motivation so that I can drink it when I'm motivated. 
I've actually recently purchased her pad of productivity to keep me productive. One thing that I would advise here is be sure to take your time when you visit this shop. Things are easily missed. I like to wander around a few times to really take everything in. I especially like to take a few laps back around to the pin section, just in case some more pins can tempt me. So be sure to check the description down below to find out where you can find Punny Dukes as well as their social media and a big thank you to Katie for letting me show you guys around her store. I'll be sure to drop in again soon and thank you guys for watching. Bye!